So, all my TPU users with their excellent carbons. One thing you want to look out for is when you are pulling that thing out to hook the AMS back up and it has cut the, the, the filament, what you want to make sure of is when you pull that out of there that it looks like this at the end and not like this. Because you pull it out and it snaps like that, especially with the soft filament, um, it's, it's basically stuck in there. And what's going to happen is you're not going to be able to hook the AMS up back up and it's not going to want to feed anything because it believes there's filament that you still have to pull back but because it's so small you have to take the top of the extruder off and it's sitting inside of that sensor you know there's gonna be two little silver screws next to that clear plastic piece where the line goes in you have to take that off and pull this piece out and that'll clear any kind of confusion for the printer so you might all recognize this piece this is the sensor I'm talking about and it's at the top of the extruder and what you want to look out for is that that piece is just under this or still stuck in it because it has this little metal tab right here which lets it know that there's something still inside the extruder so if you've exhausted all options you can't figure out why it won't feed from the AMS it keeps saying there's stuff in there that is your culprit it just takes um two there's two little silver set screws there's a hole for them and it'll be at the top left side of the extruder where your line goes in and you want to make sure that that's clear also you want to make sure that this part is springy and tight and it's not weak because that'll give it a false signal see how it's getting stuck and i gotta push it back what's going to happen now is it's going to think that there's ex a filament in the extruder when it's not. So you want to make sure that it springs back into place every time. So watch out for that and you'll be good to go when it comes to your printer thinking the extruder's clogged or that there's still filament in it. So I hope that's helpful for anyone who's encountered this.